reason number 176 on why everyone should know how to scuba dive or free dive and hold your breath a long time. Last night, my phone and my wallet. My phone is my wallet. It all went overboard. Two of my other credit cards, my driver's license, my Home Depot card, $50 in cash. I don't know. I'm going to try to go back and uh, find it before I go uh, cancel all my cards, have to go to the DMV, have to go to the phone store. Let me just get one thing out there real quick. This video has nothing to do with Apple as a product. Actually, I was always an anti-Apple guy. I'm not a fan of iTunes. I'm not an Apple guy in general. But the Apple iPhone 11 Pro and the Pro Max, I read online somewhere that they were in fact secretly waterproof and i put it to the test it was too dark last night i got in but i couldn't see anything so i marked the spot it's monday morning this is the phone salvage dive Twenty minutes later. <sighs> so not the salvage dive that I wanted to do, but the phone's recovered. My driver's license, credit cards, Home Depot card, phone, and the alarm's going off. Is that how you found it? You heard the alarm? <laughs> no, I just saw it sitting there. <laughs> I just saw it sitting there. Here, I don't know if you can grab it or not. I almost feel like I need to take it home and put it in rice before I even mess with it. They said those things are pretty water resistant. There are some gnarly looking crabs down there. Like, I don't even know what they were. They look like giant friggin' tarantulas. Yuck. I'm not real sure what the hell they were. I got my phone back. I got all my credit cards back. And best of all, my phone works. So I took the phone to the U-Brake iFix because I was afraid to plug it into the charging port because if it did have water in it, which I assumed it would have, then that itself would have fried the phone. I took it up there to the U-Brake iFix. He opened it up free of charge to look at it, see if there's any kind of water or any kind of corrosion damage. And I go back an hour later, it's bone dry. Everything works. The facial recognition works, which they said probably wouldn't. Speakers work, everything works. So, so far, so good. I got everything back and I'm pretty happy. It was a good day. So what started out as a grim doom and gloom Monday ended up being pretty cool. Pretty happy with how waterproof it is. <laughs>